In this video, I'll show you how to create a custom monster with custom behavior and monster data. Right-click to create a new Blueprint class, then search for Monster NPC. Select it and name it. Now we create the monster data. Right-click again and hover on Miscellaneous, then select Data Asset, and search for Monster Data. Select it and choose a name for it. In the Monster Data Asset, you'll find all the settings you need for your monster. The first section includes behavior settings, speed parameters, and behavior animation. The second section covers health, damage behavior, hit reactions, and death animation. The third section is the ability section. Here you can control the monster's combat behavior and add the monster abilities. I'll show you how to add your own abilities later. But for now, we'll just use the default melee attack. Now that we've finished setting up the monster data, let's add it to the monster blueprint. In the monster class default settings, find the monster kit section. Here you can select your monster data asset. You can also assign a team tag to the monster to prevent it from attacking other monsters. Select the monster's skeletal mesh and its animation blueprint. If the Blueprint Editor is in full view mode, you'll find the Class Defaults menu on the right. Put the monster in the map, and here we go. You can create any number of monster data assets, allowing each monster to have its own behavior, abilities, and team.